So that, as you know, I stumbled a little bit there. And if I tweak my script uh, there, I can probably smooth that out with a little bit more practice. But again, if you were listening, you heard that I was excited about helping them, and I gave them valuable information as I went through it. I was telling them, in essence, good things a website should have, and then, of course, they could see it with the video. So we were using the power of video and of course audio and we had images so you could take the similar concept make some short videos in any niche that you choose and then you can apply it to the tip number one from last week which was make an image of a video put it into your email write a short little letter that goes with it they can listen to it, and it goes perfectly with the demonstration website concept that Jack has already created for you, so that you have a little video that explains it. You could be showing them either a generic demo website or the demonstration website, depending on the method or, or how you decide to do it. But this method, I think, can be very powerful because you're using the power of video, you are having show and tell, and then if you're using the demo website, you've got that already. And you didn't say, oh, it took me two seconds to make it. You, you basically are saying, I thought enough of you to have this created for you and then, of course, we can take the time to really perfect it later. So that is Tammy's tip for this week. And I kind of like the idea of, I was, uh, Jack made a comment to me about we should call it, you know, Tammy's golden nugget. And so I really, I kind of took that to heart and I thought, that every little tip is like building your local marketing business one gold nugget at a time. And then, of course, implement it Monday to make more money this week. I thought, I really think that this tip could help you make money this week. So that's Tammy's tip. Thank you, Tammy. Let everybody applaud for Tammy. I have Thank been you. quiet for a while because I didn't want to interrupt the recording and I answered your guys' questions so you didn't hear the keyboard, but you, it was fantastic. That video, what you created, that was awesome. Uh, I think everybody can have seen how simple it can be, how you can do it in a couple of minutes and you just send it out. It's all about action, guys. It's not about difficulty. You have all the tools you use. So, a couple of technical questions. Okay. Uh, what um, emulator did you use? In for do you have a preference or do you remember? Or um, I just went and I did a Google search and and I just found. Um, I actually looked at a couple. And I think this was just called mobileemulator.com or, or something. And I saw one for like brick and mobile, but it uh, locked up on me. So I just went with the one that worked. Yeah. It, so you can use any any mobile emulator. Um, like I said, I just Googled, did a Google search for mobile emulator, and then I... I I uh, played with it to see, well, what does this website look like, you know, with the, in an iPhone or an Android or a BlackBerry, you know, and then I, I said, oh, look at tablet. Let's see what it looks like in a tablet because I really think it's important to show people at least examples. If you were doing this in a generic video, 
I think what you could do is, it, what I would do is I'd go find a couple examples of a website that just didn't fit, you know, like let's say you're doing um, HVAC air conditioning companies and you found a couple examples, you know, that just didn't fit. So at least they can get the concept of, oh my goodness, I, I should be checking this. And of course, if it's their website, if you're doing the custom client um, way where you, you know, it's going to take a little bit more time per client, um, then, then of course, you would go find their real website. But I wanted to point out that I never said they had a bad website. I just said, I found your site and I see you need some updates to bring it current. I, 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 I just avoided, there was an entire conversation the other day on the Facebook page about how do you tell someone their website sucks and, and, um, and the reason that probably came up was because I actually used that term in one of my presentations, but that was my attempt at being humorous. So, I, you know, maybe it didn't work because I'm kind of a serious person, but I do try to be lighten up every now and then you know, with a little bit of humor, but maybe it just doesn't translate. But really, if you just show somebody that, you know, they can determine, they don't need to be told. And a lot of these people, what happens is their website is something that they did years ago and they just don't pay attention anymore because it's probably not working for them. It's probably just there and they don't even have a, an idea that their website actually could be helping them to get more clients and customers in the door because they, they don't even know that all they have is a brochure. They, they, a lot of these people, they really don't know. And I, and I know that a lot of people go, when they go do presentations and talk, that they'll, they'll stand in front of these people and they'll act like the only thing that's hot are, is Facebook or social media and they'll totally ignore any other media like old school media, direct mail and magazines and websites. Although websites, even though I never ever wanted to sell websites, I probably sold more websites than other services because that's what people, they all know they, they need to have a foundation of their online presence and a website should be that foundation. And that was actually one of the things I personally struggled with um, with websites and why when the digital marketing thing came out, it was like I jumped on that. That was when I became an enterprise member <laughs> was that digital website and I went, oh my God, I've got to have that because, you know, the other ones were phenomenal and fabulous, but when I could use it myself, I jumped on that and I had that site up like within hours because it was something i would personally been looking for. I wanted that beautiful website with, with the lead capture and the social media icons and the video and, you know, just it had everything that i had been looking for and teaching about and my website I, I wasn't even able to have that until I, I got my local local theme jack. And I know that sounds, um, I don't know what it sounds like, but it's all the truth. <laughs> that, that's the thing about, about it. It's the absolute truth. And that's how I, I ended up talking to you is because I started using local theme jack and now I'm using the lead finder and the, they're tools that are just they far surpass other tools that I've been using since 2010. So, so for me to say that, I think, because believe me, I've tried everything under the sun um, for myself and then also for my clients. I mean, these tools are really fabulous and the fact that they're always being improved based on the users, I think is really phenomenal. Okay, not a bad comment at the end, but um, <laughs> <laughs> um, what I wanted to say. So, 
question to you guys. If you have um, sales dynamite, but that's all what you need, is the enterprise plus the business definer. Enter yes. Okay. Gary has it. Uh, David, Steve, Roger, Tony, Chris, Tom, Mike, James, Brian, Colette. Dennis, Lydia, Kathy Ray, Dale, Don, Carl, Ed, Chris, Jim, Jimmy, Ronald. So, a lot of you guys have it. Now, if you do not have Sales Dynamite, enter no. Nelson doesn't have, I don't think I do. Dag, Dale. Robert, Joe is not sure. Sabrina has it. Uh, Nelson has lead finding jack standard. So, what is the sales dynamite? Okay. So, if you want to implement it tomorrow, and it's actually you know today, or whatever, depending on your time. Um, and you want to have this replay, you want to have all the Tamish material, you want to have this short presentation at your fingertips, you, will, you, you would like to have all the trading what comes with, you just grab Sales Dynamite Jack for, is it $27 still? I think it is. $27, I think. $27. So... I don't know, if, Tammy, can you see that link or can you put it? Um, yes, I see you? a link. It says something about salesdynamitejack.com. Yeah. Yes, I see, I see that in, okay, in the chat. Okay, so if you go to that link, then it's still for $27. And you have everything. Everything what Tammy showed tonight, you can implement for $27. You have the enterprise plus the business lead finder. The business lead finder, I showed you this earlier. It has tracking. It finds owner's name. It has everything what you can dream of. Together, it is $27 the first month and $59 the, the, the other month. And, and, and the section what I didn't show is the... The Best Lead Finder, it works in any country. Canada, United Kingdom, any any country. So I just wanted to point it out because um, what Tammy just showed tonight, you opened 10 tabs and you go over this presentation everybody can do that okay you can even have a script you know in front of you and you just read that script it's, it's not difficult the sales done by Jack includes enterprise so if you have the enterprise but not the business lead finder you want to grab it and then you just reply send a support ticket and say, hey Jack, I already have uh, Enterprise, so cancel that one. Okay. So if you have Enterprise and not the busy finder, you just grab it to get access from the busy finder and then uh, we will cancel the Enterprise view and you only have the busy finder. And that includes the enterprise plus the business lead finder. So Dave said, success, I did my first webinar today for a local dentist, bundled with good quality two minutes promo video offer. Uh, I received $1,500 for the website and the video. Thank you, Jack. So do you think I make this notes up? Do you? So I get those comments, Jack, I cannot sell your website for more than 199 No, it's, it's relative to what they, um, to, to the niche. And if you have a higher monthly, you don't need to ask $1,500. So Philip said, 
Thank you, Tammy. I really value your training and input. You are knowledgeable and very inspiring. Glad Jack recognized that you have a lot to offer and I think that along with Jack's generous training, most of us really look forward to your tips and training as well. So that's a comment from Philip. Thank you, Philip. That's nice. How many? I appreciate it. Yeah, I do too. Thanks, Philip. So, how many websites can we create with Sales Dynamo Jack? Ten per month. And if you want more, you just buy ten more for forty-nine dollars. So. Where's the replay from tip one on the enterprise plus section? So if you go to the, if you are an enterprise user, you have access to it. If you're not, then you don't have access to it. So you want to get access to it and get that sales dynamite jack deal and you have access to everything. Does that uh, call tracker work? in the USA as in Australia and New Zealand. It has a little bit delay but but it is pretty good. USA we have more servers than in Australia but it's pretty good. Oh Jack I wanted to say that these tips build on one another and every what I do is I actually I look at the feedback from everybody on the call and that's how I ended up developing this week's tip. Next week I actually am going to build on this tip number three is going to be, a, I'm going to give you a couple more examples of types of videos you could make for example, um, somebody mentioned, I think, on the site about um, you could do a video about, oh my God, I, you know, created a website for another client. They decided not to buy it. Um, would you like, would you like to buy it at a discounted rate? I, I, I want to share some different ideas about uh, different. I guess they would be techniques that you could use and that will be tip number three. So I, I think that that way it will kind of like wrap it all up and give people, you know, more bullets for their gun, I guess, uh, on that. And then I think, um, well, that's what I know, that that was the idea that I got that tip number one, tip number two, and then tip number three would all be related and then obviously I don't know. I don't know what tip number four is going to be, but I do know that um, that that's what I'm planning for next week. So everybody should tune in to learn about that, you know, to learn about different ways to talk to your audience, you know, on, on and what what it all what happens is one of these idea, ideas is going to resonate with you more than others. And so whatever resonates with you, that's the one that you should do because you want to do what you can implement. And you know how they always say money loves speed and I never really understood what that even meant, but it really means if you can implement your ideas quickly, the money will come in faster. So however you use this, if you use it in email, Again, you can use this technique in a live situation. Just let your imagination uh, kind of take you where it needs to go on using these little tips because like Jack has said, these are pretty simple techniques, but they're, they're very powerful. So I got a question. Is Lead Finder Jack, Busy Lead Finder included in Sales Dynamo Jack? Yes, with Sales Dynamo Jack, you have everything. You have the best WordPress team and you have the best uh, lead finder tool. Okay, so 
Vicky, you uh, 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 ask a long question, but let me answer it quickly. If a client has a website and is concerned about SEO ranking by installing the new website, I have seen multiple in cases that the ranking improves instead of go worse. I hope that answers your question. Uh, if you are concerned about the content you lose, you want to make a backup. So, let me ask question uh, directly because, you know, I'm a mill. Uh, who wants to hear tip number three next week? Who's ready for tip number three next week? Say yes or no, you know, so I, we, we can plan our time. I'm not, you don't hurt me when you say no. Yeah, and, and again, if you don't like that, I, you know, I don't have to do it. <laughs> or if you have a better idea that you'd rather learn, I'm, I'm open. I, I'm very flexible and, uh, you know, I was thinking about it the other day. If you remember Mary Poppins, you remember how she had her, her um, carpet bag and what she would open it up and whatever she needed just came out. That's kind of how I am. I have a lot of ideas and a lot of things I've tried and used successfully. And so I, I just try to pull out what I think is going to make the biggest impact on your business this week or tomorrow. Like if you learn it, like I said, if you learn it tonight and you implement it on Monday, is this going to help you make money this week? Because I know the biggest issue for me when I was first starting out or even now is am I using my time appropriately and is it going to help me make more money, i.e. support my family? You know, what is my big why? My big why is I have a family to take care of and this is how I'm choosing to do it. I, you know, I don't want a job you know to me a job is a dirty word i did it for 35 years and i don't want to do it anymore i like what i'm doing i enjoy, i love teaching you guys stuff and all of the comments that you guys give me it just motivates me to go oh okay i'll i'll do more you know i'm pretty i'm one of those people you know it's like like the dog you pat it on the head and it just wiggles and wags and loves you to death that's me when i get positive reinforcement for, for what I'm doing, so thank you. I appreciate it. Do you guys hear that? That is how Tommy works, and you probably know that, but if you are very responsive in your comments in Facebook and you show up, you know, Tommy is willing to give you more tips. <laughs> Some uh, Karen, Karen uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce her name, Stavert, Stavert. she says, I heard that your site sucks hidden in your presentation. Hee <laughs> hee. That's funny. <laughs> she was the one who had the big conversation about your site sucks. That's funny. <laughs> oh, and then somebody said, like a billboard. Well, to me, uh, I try to speak. Uh, I'm sure all of us do it naturally, but when I speak to people, I try to speak to them in a language that they can understand. And for example, I had I have a big jeweler client. And I'm not kidding. They he invited me he and his wife invited me to their house on a Sunday to talk about business. He's sitting there in swim trunks and he's like a little woolly bear and she's in her bathrobe and I'm like you know, she makes me a cup of coffee, and I'm sitting there, like, going, oh, my God, you know, what? and I'm trying to talk to them about their web presence and sell them on the idea that they need to pay me, I think it was like $25,000 a year to do a bunch of stuff. And so I'm trying to explain to him the value of video marketing and why I thought 
they should let me spend money making videos and optimizing them um, as well as their website. And I, I was talking to him and his eyes were glazing over, okay? And I looked out and they lived on a canal that led out to Charlotte Harbor, sailboat water out, and, I, and his wife had told me that back in the 70s they bought this this lot for like sixty thousand dollars and everybody thought they were crazy for spending that much money on a on this lot well of course now it's worth a couple million dollars so it i got this ding 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 in my head and it was explain to them that their videos and their website and their reputation was like owning waterfront property and I said that to him, and his the light bulb went on because I was able to say, well, wouldn't you rather, if you had been able to, wouldn't you have rather bought all of the waterfront lots on this peninsula, and then you would have owned all of this waterfront property, and it would have been worth millions of dollars? And when I said that, I said, well, that's what having digital assets is in the online world. Every video is like owning waterfront property. Your website is a big piece of waterfront property. Your um, reviews are like waterfront property. And that is how I was able to communicate that. And they, they did end up signing a contract that day, and they're still my clients. So when you can speak the language uh, of your potential clients so that they can understand the simple like digital assets equates to if you can put it into some real world example it, it really helps that that's a big tip in itself is learn to speak the language of your potential customers and clients and you'll find that if they get it then they will love you forever and that particular client it's very interesting because um, I'm going to help him make um, like a Google Hangouts show about uh, jewelry and um, antiques and he actually told me he said you made me realize how valuable online marketing was and until I talked to him in his language he, he just you know, he was like a brick wall on that. So that's actually a really good tip aside. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. One tip a week was the agreement. <laughs> so oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Just kidding. So um, I really appreciate your guys' feedback. That motivates you, motivate us to do more. Uh, if you promise to come back next week, we will have uh, something else for you already. Sounds that good? So, what you can do now, uh, hang out a little bit in Facebook. We are around that also hanging out. So if we missed your question uh, or you want to leave a comment, that would be uh, great. And if you are an enterprise or a uh, sales dynamic user, you are in luck. You will see the replay section. You will see the um, the download what uh, Tommy um, is prov providing. So you will have all that extra, what you like to make this, uh, to put it in, in, to work. So with that said, I appreciate your guys' attention. I want to thank Tammy because he put a lot of effort in this today to, um, uh, to put this together. I hope you guys see it. That is not something in presentation what we used a half year ago or whatever no that is customized for your guys so I hope you you see how much work Tammy put in it to summarize this to bring this 
in a way that is easy to understand and easy to implement. So thanks everybody and thanks Tammy for doing such a great job. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thanks everybody and do come back and do feel free to ask me questions and again all of this it's you know it's suggested but you can take the idea and just make it your own that that's the beauty of all of this is you know you don't have to be married to the script or to any exact way of doing it because it, it all boils down to you and your personality okay now I have one last thing Tuesday we have it other session is completely different and there's something what you need all of you guys need there's nobody of your guys who don't need it so I'm I'm working on a special presentation what all of you guys need so that is how I